I'll grab a cuppa before we start the vlog. Let's go. Yo, yo, how's it going? Marlon King here. It's been a while since I've done a vlog, right? Um, and yeah, well, I hope you're doing well. I don't even know where to begin. There's so, uh, so much that's been going on. But let's start with a few things. Uh, my favorite of which, uh, I've bought a new guitar. Um, as we can see here, this uh, black one. I've been wanting to get an ESP guitar for ages. And I'd actually been looking at their, um, LTD range, uh, in particular the 1000. However, I then come across this 256, which um, has non active pickups, uh, has a really nice sound, and uh, someone's selling one in my local area, so it would have been rude not to get it, right? So uh, I'll make a video in more detail on that one coming soon. So definitely stay tuned for that if you like guitars. Uh, what else has been going on? Oh, right, well, I had a week off and I've been doing some garage storage, like a really mundane task, but you know what, if you don't have your garage organized, it can be a right pain. And I've actually made a vlog about that, I haven't released it yet, I'm still in the editing process, but stay tuned for that, for you know some giggles, I'm sure you'll enjoy it, but some practical advice if you've got a garage or shed, and you wanna make it a little bit more maintainable and easy, because uh, like literally it got to the point where my garage, I couldn't even walk in there, it was ridiculous. Um, so definitely check that one out. And then what else? Well, I've just bought this wireless charger from Tozo. Uh, now, I have previously had phone cases from them, been quite impressed. Um, I haven't actually had a wireless charger since my old Windows phone. Um, but this one now does 10 watt charging. So I, I believe Samsung phones, I'm, I'm on Samsung, so is my wife. Uh, so we should be able to get the 10 watt charging. Um, however, iPhones also support 7.5 watt charging, so you could use it on that as well. This is the W1. And I, I was looking through several products actually. Oh, let's, let's open it up now, if I can get into the packaging. I was looking at several products, but this one, the reason I liked it was, it was super thin. It's five millimeters thick supposedly. Right, I'll, I'll hold it up just to make life easier. So this is the box, there we go. And I've opted for this blue color, um, but it should actually be white, I'm hoping. Um, let's find out. It's not much in the box, just a cable and a charger. One of the things that I really liked about this is it looks like a coaster. Um, Look at that, that is pretty thin. And it's just got one single port uh, USB-C, I believe, on the side. Comes with cable, which is white also, so nice. And that should blend in really nicely on my white desk. Uh, that's the plan. Uh, means I can charge while I'm working, um, or, you know, can use it anywhere else. Uh, so I'll let you know how I get on with this one. But some nice features on this as well, outside of being five millimeters thick, um, as you can see there. Um, it has a little blue light that should light up when charging, um, which is a nice touch. It also has foreign detection, so if you put keys or anything on it, it's not going to cause issues or spark up or ignite or anything. It also has an overheating mode, so <laughs> not deliberately overheating, but to counteract any overheating. So if you're using a thick case or anything like that, if it detects it's getting hot, it should cut out so you don't burn anything. Plugged it in, got a nice green standby light. Let's put the phone on. There we go. We can see the phone has just popped up to say it's charging as well. So uh, that's a Samsung Note 9 on it at the moment. And then take that off, goes back to green. I don't know if you can see some rubber pads on the bottom just so it doesn't scratch any of your surfaces or slide off a surface either. What else is there? Actually, there's, there's some more tech stuff coming soon as well. I've been wanting to try out some of these fitness watches, um, but you, you can get the smart watch, but you can also get ones that are specific just for training. So I'm looking forward to trying one of them out soon. Uh, in particular, this Huawei one, which um, it's not something I'd usually get. 
but I thought, why not? Let's try it out. So stay tuned for that as well. Um, you remember the other year or a while back, I made a video about um, me relocating a bush. I, I believe the video is titled Dead Bush. Um, definitely check it out if you haven't already seen it. However, the moral of that story was the, uh, the bush died. I've now bought a nice plant to replace it. And I'm not gonna make a video about that because I'm hoping this one's gonna survive. But I've got a nice red robin. Check this out. Yeah, so pretty chuffed with this one. Yeah, so all in all, I believe that covers off the main things. Guitar, charger, bush, uh, and more tech to come soon in videos. I am planning on doing another investment video or like money making video should I say because I've been trying out a few things over the last few months and I thought it was about time I gave another update so stay tuned for that. Camera gear wise I haven't bought any new camera gear in the last few weeks or months uh, I've been waiting for July announcements to see what's coming out now I know Sony have released a few full frame lenses However, I'm not in the full frame market, so not of interest to me. But there are a few interesting lenses that have come out. There's been a 17 to 70 from Tamron, and also there's rumors of an 11 to 20 lens, which has uh, piqued my interest. However, of course, not been officially announced yet, so we'll just have to see whether that actually does get released. And the most important thing, whether it's got any stabilization on it, because if it doesn't, it's gonna be a little bit useless, as in as my current camera doesn't have IBIS. And of course, if I've missed anything, if you're thinking, or if you're subscribed to this channel and you're thinking, why hasn't he done another video about this? Please let me know in the comments, because I'd love to hear what you wanna see from me in the future. Uh, but as it stands, that's what I've currently got lined up and I hope you are looking forward to that. And outside of that, I hope you are just well in general and looking forward to spring because I would say spring's here, although it was like pretty much snowing yesterday in Britain, so it's been a bit weird. But outside of that, um, I'm ready, I'm charged up, I'm game. So let's hope that summer is gonna be good and everything's back to normal. And on that note, I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.